There we go. Okay, so what you've got here is the hexane uh, on the top and the water on the bottom. And you can see they're immiscible, okay, so they're not mixing. Um, and also you have here, just like we did before, we've got some iodine. Can you see that? Um, solid sitting in some water, okay. So we said the iodine didn't dissolve in the water. Iodine is held together by London forces, whereas the water is held together by hydrogen bonds. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to add the um, iodine and water to here. Hopefully the water will float out and we're going to watch what happens. Might need to just um, pop them in with a bit of this. And we're going to give it a shake because obviously if we want a reaction to happen between those two layers, we want something to happen, we're going to have to mix the layers together. So we do that. Sorry, moving around. And what's happening? Where's the iodine going? Okay, so you can see there that the iodine has dissolved in the hexane layer. All right. So remember again, iodine is held together by London forces. Okay different molecules of iodine held together by land forces, and the hexane similar. So we've got, again, like dissolves like. Things that are held together by similar forces will dissolve each other. That'll do.